So uh, this is, I did not change the name. Oh, I also didn't change this. Come on, come on, get, get on your game. All right, so this is the red, white feather deck. Uh, you could call it Boros, if you like, that uh, did well this past weekend at the uh, Mythic Frontier? No, Mythic Friendship? No, Magic Freedom? What does MF stand for again? Oh, no, the GP. It did well at the GP this past weekend. <laughs> um, yeah, so I'm going to try it out because the first time I tried it out, I did not do so well with the Feather deck. And people have been tuning it and doing stuff with it, and it top aided. So I don't, I don't know what won. It might have been this, honestly. I really don't know. Um, but anyway, let's give it a whirl. Ooh. I cast 30 white spells, and I get... Oh, yes. That's how you want to do your coins right there. That's how you want to do the coins. All right, win the coin flip. Ah, we already failed. Oh, I should probably change my avatar, huh? Uh, I think you're supposed to keep this. It's got three of the best creatures you can possibly have in this deck and a Defiant Strike, so yeah. Kind of a tough call, like, do you play Dreadheart Arcanist or do you play... Uh, I think I'm just going to play Dreadhorde here. Red Horde does silly things. Okay, blue, red, kill a thing. Sure, sure. I guess I could have done this, but eh, it's fine. I'm going to put this into play tapped and play the second one. Like, maybe my life total means too much for, for this to be particularly good here. Phoenix. Okay. Birds of a feather. All right, well, let's see what we can do here. Rats. The answer was not a whole lot. Okay, get our spell back. Each player puts the top four cards of the library into the graveyard, return up to two instants and or sorcerers. Okay, sure. Interesting. I don't believe I've read that card past the uh, spoiler. cat nonsense happening with just off stream. Hey, you're not supposed to be able to put that back in your hand. Oh, I did this at the end of the turn. I did that wrong. I totally did that wrong. Does it matter? Um, three, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. Two, four, six, eight. No, no, no. It's one short. It's one short. It's one short. Oh, Lord. I, I miss lethal because of when I did that. That's so dumb. And now I have to kill their bird instead. Uh, all right. 
right, so we're going to cycle this. Cycle this again. Rats. All right, sure. Kill this. Three. I mean, I should have played the white land. It doesn't matter. Just can't give that haste. All right. And then we kill them. Okay. We drew the right mix of creatures and stuff, so that's good. Uh, uh, let's see. So these spells kill all their stuff. Tajik sounds better than Krinko here. I don't like Krinko in this matchup, is basically what I'm getting at. Uh, we have 17 creatures. Reckless Rage seems great. Gird seems great. Uh, Shock doesn't kill a whole lot of their things. They don't have Planeswalkers either. And this is a little embarrassing on the draw, but that puts us to 15 creatures. Well, 16 creatures, because we have Gideon. I've played decks with 16 creatures before. Cats. All right, go. This is getting lightning struck, almost certainly. Oh. Okay, there we go. There it is. There's the Drakes I know and love. Uh, hmm. I'm just going to attack. I'm going to leave up Sheltering Light. A little telegraphed, I know, but... Apparently not that te telegraphed. Uh, yeah, fourth land is fine. And they concede. Neat. Neat. Nineteen creatures typically. Okay, that's good to note. This is a one land do nothing hand. So my first mulligan. Oh gosh, I can't wait for next month. And I would know if this is a land or not. Because if that's a land, I can just like push like this to the bottom, maybe, or even gird. Uh on the draw with a scry. Uh, always punished. Come on, London Mulligan. Come on, July. Mm. 
I guess I can technically cast this without any creatures in play. Thought erasure. I can't wait for this to. Oh god, it's gonna be in the format forever. Because it's part of the the guild's nonsense. <sighs> All right, land. Fair. That's fair. I'm not even going to let them know I drew that. Fair. All right, Esper nonsense. Uh, let's see. Esper nonsense. Hard to remove creature. These things. Uh, that seems good. Then we can cut. Gosh, I might just cut Gerd. Gerd. Oh, these aren't as good. I'll cut one of those. Like, they might have the three, four, though. So I'll keep a couple in just as a just in case. And a couple of these, but I want to keep them in in case they have planeswalkers and then a Gerd. Yes, yes. Mulligan. Oh, goodness gracious me. All right. Well, here's the gamble again. We're like, if I knew the next card was this land, I would, like, push a 10th district to the bottom. So I guess it's good that it was a land. Boom. Two damage. <laughs> Thought erasure. Oh, no, they're just going to kill it. Cool. Neat. Land? That is decidedly not a land. Wow, I even have the right spell for that. Thought erasure. Nope. Just. Oh, yep. There's the thought erasure. She's going to take. She's going to take. Take Reckless Rage. Come on. I know you want to. No, you wanna. Oh, rats. And a tip to Uh, yep. Definitely just gonna hold on to Sheltering Light here. Until they play this Vraska's Contempt and I cry. How does this work? Oh, it has to attack. Right, right. Alright, cycle. Um, kind of just want a fourth land, but like Feathers, the best card in my deck. Okay, okay, bye, cat. Yeah. Alright. Hello. Yeah. Right. Maybe color line, but this doesn't look like real aggro. It shouldn't. Did I not? There. It's fixed, I guess. All right, so I'm at Sprint. Oh. Yeah, I I typed the title, but I didn't hit update, apparently. Keep up the pace. Keep up the pace.
Ugh, I hate it. I am not going to get this one. Uh, I two owed a Drake's player, and I lost game one to not drawing a second land because we don't have the London Mulligan yet, and I feel very far behind right now because they have twin tefts. So, you know, about where you'd expect a creature combat trick deck to be. That doesn't do it, huh? You just have these things that don't, like, destroy my creatures. Yeah, definitely. October can't come soon enough, huh? Although we'd still have this one for forever. This one is somehow more tolerable to me than this one, but they're still both pretty annoying. I... Brought the, I kept two of these in because I wasn't sure if they were a mid-range or a control deck, and I wish I hadn't kept this in. I wish I hadn't. Uh, why can't I? Oh, I can't tap free. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's the uh, Planeswalker deck one. Not good. Not good at all. Yep. I mean, this is technically lethal, but, like, they have the Wrath, so... Which is why I kept a creature on top. But this is at three. And this is at two. So, Shrug. I get my card back? No? Oh, I guess because they died... Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I've never seen these freaking uh dragonflies before. Hold that thought. I was like, wait, what is the subs command? <laughs> Where did you get this command from? It's in my title, oh no. <laughs> Sure. <laughs> Has best card, spends five minutes casting it. Got it. Got it. Got it. <laughs> You're a liar. <laughs> You're a thief. What's that? Is that your broken rock? Oh, it is broken. Yeah, so I glued it together. Good. What's the other side look like? Ooh. Mike fits. Where does he fit? Mm hmm. Is it his name is Mike Fitz? F I T Z. Where does he fit? Is ha ha ha. I'm funny. Part of me wanted to play Mountain on one, so I could shock something. Cool. Shock wouldn't have mattered. Whoa! Party Bus CEO with the sub. Welcome. Welcome. Let me uh, 
decide what I'm doing here, and then I will send you a quick message. Welcome to the bunch. Your support is greatly appreciated. No, I... There you go. Rip. Uh, block. Um... Trying to think here. Oh, I can just shock this. So I can shock this. Reckless Rage this. And Defiant Strike. Back to find strike. Seems decent. Uh, I never draw Sam at sprint. Never ever. Not a once. Shock your face. Um, yeah, I'm going to play Krenko out. <sighs> right? Well, I mean, that's why you have Samet Sprint in here. I just don't draw it. Shrug. <laughs> Do I have Reckless Rage? I do. I do, in fact, have Reckless Rage. Maybe I should have hit one of these, but I can't kill that, typically. Um, Oh, that's perfect. I don't have to kill my Ar Ar Arcanist here. All right, we're on the offensive. Jade Light Ranger. Looking for them lands. <laughs> I had two gob friends. Oh, yes. I just, I used uh, Reckless Rage and I targeted one of them. Now I want to do this so that I can grab Gird for battle. And I can hit this. And we'll say this. Yeah! Taste it. Taste it. All right. Takatli Honor Guard. Get in my deck. And these as well. All right. Opponent didn't want it. Not at all. Uh, let's see. Maybe we cut this cute package. And three more cuts. Gerd is like... Shut up. <laughs> Shut up, cat. I think Gerd is my most off. Like, it's the best, like, combo piece, but 
it doesn't do a whole lot of protecting. Like, I'd rather have a sheltering, sheltering light or or even a Defiant Strike, which cycles, than, than Gird. So I think this is good. Very low to the ground, but also I can kill all their stuff. Oh. What happened? Oh. Wait, where did my fourth... Hmm. Sure, we'll keep one of these boys in. Is that what I want to keep in? Actually, let's keep a shock in. All right. No cat cam, but there is a cat on my lap. <laughs> uh, I have no idea. <laughs> I brought him in. Uh, I, I guess you would want, like, against control. Ooh, is that a good draw? Is that a good draw? Like... He's hard to remove, so I guess, like, mostly control matchups. As a sticky threat. Please don't fatal push me one time. Thank you. <laughs> Sideboard cards are too OP. All right, all right. So we're two and one, lost to Esper, but beat Dreadhorde and Drakes. So if your deck has a, a D in its name, no, cat, cat, cat. There was a microphone there. Cat! <laughs> oh my gosh. No respect for the microphone, huh? Oh, we won a coin flip. Uh, oh, we have a Danto in here. Okay. Nick might not be built right. I guess they just didn't draw any, uh... Wait. Why is cat cam not working? Dear cat cam. There we go. Well, I'm sorry, but... I had to manually turn the camera on like a heathen. Like some sort of manual tapper. Oh no. It's the espers. Hopefully we do better this time. I guess, theoretically... Okay, never mind. It's Esper. Why? Man. I'm going to get sick of... I'm already sick of this card, and it, and it sticks around after rotation. Feather. Stop. Stop pretending like it's any other card. You're taking Feather. Okay. You don't have to write anything down. My hand's going to stay here. Gerd. All right. Cycle this. Gosh, that hits hard. I'm pretending to leave up the indestructible. Sp oh, this gives itself indestructible, huh? I guess I should have girded. But I drew feather, so if I draw land... Eh, it's a close one. Moment of craving? Is that what's happening here? Or are you just reading a card that's been in standard for forever? Uh... <laughs> sure. My prowess is unmatched by you. Hone your prowess. Three, four, five, six, seven. No. It's not enough to kill them, unfortunately. Uh, do I kill this Narset? Hmm. 
Oath of Kaya, you say? Um, I do have cards that draw cards, strangely enough. I won't forget our time together. So, in the face of Oath of Kaya, I'm going to play this out and then get Wrathed. But, there you go. If I don't get... If I don't eat a Wrath, then next turn should be fun. Uh, resolves. You literally spent five minutes last turn reading it. I'm so confused. Oh my gosh. Alright, so we said Gideon... Uh, last time I kept Reckless Rage in, and it felt really bad. Uh, Sheltering Light gets in here. Legion War Boss, I suppose. Just as more aggressive things. And maybe cut a GERD. Seems dot deck. Let's try it like this. Black Waltz? Am I, did I just say something rude on accident, or is it actually like just a reference I don't get because I don't get any references ever? So the reason I started early today is because the last episode of Chernobyl is tonight. I mean, we, we watched the uh, first four episodes over the weekend, and that show is insane. So we wanted to finish it off, like, actually on time for once. I, I hardly ever watch a show when it airs. But, yeah, tonight at 9 o'clock on your, on your HBO stream that you have stolen from your friend. No, we actually pay for HBO is the, the silly part. Uh, creature. Man. This is rough, because, like, we have one creature. Sure. Duress is not the card I'm worried about. The card I'm worried about is Thought Erasure. I stole my brother's HBO. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. Like, no one really buys it, right? Is that good for you, opponent? Is that good for you? Like, taking Sheltering Light? <laughs> and on... <laughs> he has it because he uses Amazon Prime. No, yeah. I mean, like, once you have it, like, who cares? And then this will die to, like, cast down, and then I won't draw a creature forever. Oh. Um. I'm going to hold this cycle in case I, it, like, if they try to remove 10th District Legionnaire. Uh. Sure. Like, all of these are basically the same card. It's a weird one to take, in a way. Because, like, this one cycles, which is 100% what I'm going to do with it right now, maybe? Nah, I can wait. Told you I could wait. Cast my whole hand before you could see it, right?
Yes, I would like a backup plan, please. All right, backup plan engaged. Oh, they hit three mana. What you got? How dead are you? Oath of Kaya. Sure. So you're going to kill this one. I can't save it. These things happen. Samet Sprint. Samet Sprint. <laughs> um... That was fun. We did a thing a little bit. Yay! We won! <laughs> Back to gold tier two. Yeah. Uh, that was good. All right, all right. We got our 15... Look at that. Look at that. Chandra's Triumph. Claim prize. Let's open a pack. Let's get our 20, 20 things. Hey, look. It's on theme. It's on theme. Oh, we won a coin flip, too. Uh, uh. Well, it's not the best hand in the world, but we don't, we don't need another one of those, thank you. Whoa, where was that land going? It just, like, floated into the ether. Our opponent has registered Evolving Wilds, so that's a thing. Are we about to get ranched by Hidden Valley? <laughs> I'm so funny. Red, green, evolving wilds, explore. Okay. I'm not that desperate for a card. All right, live one turn. One turn, Krinko. That's all I ask of you. And then the world shall be your oyster. <laughs> Why did they float red before playing their land? What are they doing? What are you getting at, opponent? You can't undo that now. <laughs> it was infuriating, right? I didn't. Whenever I played it too, I was like, ah, whatever. I'll just run the crappy tap duels, and that's it. No, my dreams. All right, give me a two-mana creature. Land works, too. Um, do I Defiant Strike this this uh, Morphoak Branch Walker to see if I draw a creature? Is that, is that the life I'm living? Yes, I'm sure. Wow. Oh, you're running three colors. Well, there you go. I, I gave up. I got six wins, and I'm just like, I'm, I'm sick of it. Who hurt you? Wow, we're getting, like, really trampled on here, huh? Creature. Uh, three, four, five, six. I mean, we're not dead, dead, but we're pretty dead. Okay, so if I draw a feather, right? If I draw a feather, that's four, 
or three, four, five, six, and I can kill one of their things, and I'm taking seven, eight, nine, ten. So one of their things kills me next turn. Yeah, we're just dead. I I guess Krinko well no, I bottom Krinko. I had one in my opener and then I bottom the other, so So they showed us They showed us exactly one explore creature. And then everything else had Riot, which the Kotli Honor Guard doesn't shut off. So I think I just want Lava Coils here. Um, cut a Krinko. Cut a couple Gerds. Maybe the lifelink on this is, is pretty sweet. I feel like this is just for control matchups, though. They're red-green. Do they have any, like, good way? They have a bunch of creatures and burn spells. Right. I want the last Reckless Rage, too. All right. Let's try this. Uh, we will play first. Gosh, another hand where it's like, okay, but I don't play a creature until turn three, but it's also my best creature. Feels bad, man. Dot deck. Mm, and they have the land of war on one. Well, that's what I say to your Llanowar Elf. Leaving up the second shock for the inevitable second thing that is shockable. Look at that. Stop playing Llanowar Elves. Get the message. Uh, sure. It's a great draw. I will keep that. Nice. Oh, this means I can also protect her. Like if they go for, oh, what's it called? Oh, this play is sick. All right, so I get to Reckless Rage, shoot that, shoot that. Put a stop in their upkeep. Sure, I can do this too. Do I need a second one? Sure. And then I get my uh, Reckless Rage back, which means with this trigger on the stack, right? Does this work how I think it does? Okay. It does not work how I thought it worked. You lied to me. <laughs> Boo. Boo earns. <laughs> oh, well. We tried for science. Like, it's already in the process of being sacrificed, I guess. Uh, my turn... 
Hmm. Oh, that's actually a good point. Just doing it in the end step. So, oh, crap. Well, it doesn't matter. As long as I do this before their end step. <laughs> it's it's going to be... Sure. That's actually fine. Because that means what's about to happen is going to be amazing. So we take seven. Um... Going to cast this. Bottom of land. So this is a 5-5 five five now. So I can Reckless Rage like this. Then I can Reckless Rage like this. Draw my three cards back and run it back next turn. Bottom that. Matter. No, oh my gosh, Feather is dumb. Okay, we know the interaction though with Reckless Rage now for killing Phoenixes. Sure. She's basically done all the damage. Give Krenko Trample. Uh, oh, crap. I goofed. I should have played this first, huh? Doesn't matter. They're dead. <laughs> They're dead. Yay! All right, so that game reinforced my thought that uh, Tukatli Honor Guard isn't very good here. I think I'm okay with how this... Oh my gosh, that was our one of Samet Sprint, by the way, doing some work there. A Danto Vanguard on the draw is kind of sad. But I think it's still okay. I think we're, we'll be fine. Oh, look at that passive... Uh, that, that auto host from Jeff Hoagland bumping us over 40 now. Hello, all. Hello. This, this is really annoying. This is literally the third game in a row this has happened where it's like... We have four, eight, twelve, two drops, and six, three drops, and all we're getting are three drops. Well, I did ask for two drops. Land. We're on the draw. We can draw land. We have two turns to draw land. One more turn to draw land. No clifftop retreat, but land. Please. 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 And we're dead. Good talk. Good talk. Oh, it was our free one. It's fine. <laughs> this is where the magic happens. Man, I can't wait for July in the London Mulligan. Oh, 
Like, you'll look at a 7 and it has one land, and you're like, oh, I have to put one back. Eh, no. Play first, yes. Uh, yeah. I like these two drops, and Reckless Rage is a great removal spell. I even get to see what colors they're playing to decide which of these two drops I'm going to play. White. All right. So, in that case, I'm going to play Dreadhorde Arcanist. And that way I can Reckless Rage, boop, boop, swing in. Gosh, I can even gird for battle. No, that doesn't. Uh, okay. I... So, doing it like this means, one, this can block this pretty profitably, and two, I can double Reckless Rage next turn, killing two of their things. Boo! Nobody likes you. Uh, Alright. All right, well, they're still at 12 and they have no creatures in play. Plus I can make this indestructible. Not that that's very relevant here. Uh, all right. Sure. Feather. Swing with my 5-3. Oh, I could have played the land, I guess. Shrug. Yeah. It's really annoying that they have Conclave Tribunals instead of, like, damage spells. Oh, sure. Oh, they've ascended. A Danto of their own. And it looks like they're going to conclave this down. Oh, that is uh, not a conclave tribunal. All right, gonna get my scry on here. Yeah, that's good. All right, so where are we next turn? Right, so five, 10, uh, 14, 17, 21. So we're dead next turn if I don't block. So let's see what we can't find. Uh, that doesn't help. So, block, and it's 5, 9, 12, 16. Casting this now because the scry means 
because Feather will bring this back to my hand at the end of the turn, so I get two scries instead of just one. Dead to a removal spell. I'm sure this deck has never heard that phrase before. Are we dead to that? Just wondering that. 6, 11, 15, 19. Not dead. Right? 9, 12, 18 even? Oh, wait. Uh, yeah. It should be one short of lethal. Block here. Block. Give it indestructible without paying life. Gird. It's exact lethal. Oh. Six, eleven. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. I mathed wrong. I'm not often the blocker, okay? <laughs> Uh, so, Sheltering Light seems pretty medium. Reckless Rage and Lava Coil seem pretty good. Um, do I want Healing Grace? Like, I know this is a mono red card, but it's kind of interesting. Like a gain six against their eh i don't think so this is a little slow in this matchup i think this should be fine Like, I keep looking at these sixes like, well, if I have a land on top, this hand is incredible. But every time I keep it, there's no land on top. Why... Why did it not recognize my stop? I would like to know. I had a stop set, and it just passed my turn. I actually wanted to give that thing haste, and then scry one. Did I pass through my turn absentmindedly? I don't know. Reminder, good decks are good because the pilots pilot them well. Even a good deck can be piloted like poop, and you can get bad results. <laughs> I don't know. I guess I wasn't paying attention, and I accidentally allowed it to do the thing. All right. A two and a three. Best removal spell. Draw a card. A really good seven. I'm happy. Against some Azorius Jace... I have some words for you, sir. Hey, see you later. Have a good one. Doop. Oh, 
Oh, that's cute that you think that means something. It's really cute. Fourth land. Fourth land. Yeah, I'll keep that there. Means I can cast Feather and Define Strike next turn. Thorn Lieutenant! And another Elf. So, one, two, three, four. They can deal four to... Oh, never mind. Alright, they don't have enough to block it. Don't need that one. Okay. Okay. 10th District Legionnaire getting all swole. Do you concede? Oh. Come and destroy. Uh... Let's draw a card here. Let's shoot that down, shall we? Then I can leave up Shock and Defiant Strike as needed. Rats. I didn't set a stop on their thing. Uh, right, let's kill one of their elves. Badoop. Sure. Sure. Let's, uh... Yeah. Um, I'm going to put it here. Yay! Killing boards. Killing boards is fun. Uh, yeah, so Reckless Rage and Lava Coil sound great. So does Sheltering Light as protection. Krinko a little bit slow on the draw against an aggro deck. Uh, and if we're cutting Krinko, we can cut a couple of those and a Gerd. Seventeen creatures is light. Maybe maybe we put one of those friends in. Puts us to eighteen. Now, were there any other decks from the event that were interesting? I know there were good decks. I've played Gruel. I don't like Esper. Uh, Bant Ramp. 
Feral Mystic, Hydroid Crisis, Incubation Druid. Oh, this is Steal Your Girl, but Bant, right? Entrance to eh, not quite Steal Your Girl, but close. It's got four of the uh, Thief spells. Kill, kill the elf. This is good. <laughs> they just can't win. Um, get to leave up sheltering light next turn hopefully i draw land yeah that's a two five for sure oh i really want to draw land there Now I feel naked. I guess instead of playing Feather, I should have attacked with... No, but then I'd lose my creature too. Huh. Yeah, it's a 3-5. Oh, they can fight. Oh, they're going to shock her now. Okay. All right, so I give this indestructible. Hey, Tom, what's up? And then I reckless rage. Boop. Boop. I attack here. And because it's indestructible, I can grab this back. Eh. Boop, boop. And then I also kill their Domri. I'll be back after I lick my wounds. You'll see. Shrug. Rude. <laughs> Rude. Feather doesn't care, but I had this in play, so it made me a little sad. Oh, now I draw the land, okay. I have no protection. Sounds bad all right run this bad boy out and say go sure i still have six power in play oh that's so good for us that's so good for us we get to gird twice next turn gird Hi, Domery. You want off, Dom? You got it. Okay, Gerd once next turn. Still good. Oh, they can trade here. Got it. You are Reverend Dennis Dyson. Uh, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm going to cycle this. All right. They're at five. Shrug. 
these. Silent Gravestone was, was some interesting tech. Yeah, back to tier two. Well, they get... They gave a Johnny's Pride Mate a roar? That's cute. Since it's a shorter stream, I think I'm just going to chill on this one. What's the card styles for rank this time around? I don't know. <laughs> oh, wait. Um, oh, I, I thought I knew, and then I lost it. Do I risk this? How many white sources am I running? Uh, 4, 12, 16? 16 white sources. Oh, yeah, I remember that. I'm going to risk it. No risk, no reward. Yeah, one of them is really good, and then the other one is like, why that card? <sighs> what is it, though? Ugh, we lost this matchup last time. Bingo! Who doubted me? I doubt it. Rally of wings, yeah. The, like, your flying things get more flying. Oh, risk factor. That's right. No blocks. Yes. So, uh, July uh, 2nd, I think, is when it comes out on this. All right. So, we're going to deal four to this. Yeah, shock is fine. Shock this. And then to be mana efficient, we'll gird this up. Yes, I want that to stay there. Swing for five. Them attacking with a Danto Vanguard is so good for us, unless they Conclave Tribunal us. Thank you. Yeah, taste it. All right, we punish the player that Mulligan the four. Feels good, man. <laughs> uh. Yeah, those removal spells seem good. Krinko just always seems really slow to me. I don't know. Samet Sprint and a Gird. So I only cut one creature, so we're at 18? Yeah. All right. I wish there was... Like... Do I bring into Kotli Honor Guard over a Danto Vanguard just because I'm on the draw? Like, it doesn't have a ton of text in this. Well, it shuts down the elephant, I guess. That's not enough. I just want, like, a 1-3 blocker over a 1-1 one, one that costs me 4 life. I think I'm going to do that on the draw. On the play, I'll switch back.
Just trying things out, man. All right. Oh, fantastic. Exactly one removal spell and a three drop. <sighs> I can't keep this. This is better. Oh, I guess I already have one threes to block. Hmm. Herm. None shall pass. They not have a okay. I was like, wow. Honor guard or dread horde. I'm gonna go dread horde. They're both one threes, but this one has text in our deck. Uh oh, it's dead. I'm confused. It's dead. Get it? Baffling, confusing. They're synonyms. They're made from cinnamon, so they're cinnamons. Cinnamons. Okay, I tried to make that joke work way too hard. I hope you regret your baffling decision, opponent. No, don't have another one. <laughs> so rude. The fact that there's no enchantment removal in the sideboard is kind of weird. Well, time to run out the embarrassing card. Aha, take that, elephant. Uh, cycle. Are they going to counter my cycle? That's actually mildly embarrassing. Mm. So they have a counter in there, like a negate or a spell pierce. A Danto Vanguard gives them 10 permanents. You ever feel dead? Solves. <laughs> uh, yeah, sure. I mean, we're not like in a good spot, but. Oh, yeah, it's definitely Spell Pierce. Like, I have so much mana, though. All right. Uh, I'm going to cycle this first. See if it draws out anything. Well, that's a good one. I could have killed their 4-4, but I think not taking 5 is good. Krinko, not good here. They're going to have a dive down, aren't they? Alright, I want them to show me dive down. Show me potato salad. 
Like, I'm dead anyway, but if I know they have dive down... Okay, so it's spell pierce then. Um, 5, 8, 12, 16. I block 5 of 16, I go to 1, I'm dead next turn. Okay. Alright, we got the info we wanted. I guess. Uh, on the play... We take this out and bring this back in. Yeah, exactly. <sighs> they have enchantment removal. Gosh, is this Krinko feels so bad against these aggro decks? He doesn't like when you pinch his hair here. What are you doing? What's wrong? Oh, no. <laughs> mm. Excited for an animated series based on magic. That will be fun. I love how when Jeff hosts me, like auto hosts me, it's all the like passive users. So like I have 33 viewers, but they're not doing anything. Yeah, I wouldn't go that far. I mean, they've hired decent people to do it, so... Like, typically, I would agree with you. I, w I would be very doubtful. I would have no faith. But that's where we were, if you remember, when they announced they were doing Arena, right? We were like, there's no way they can do this right. And Arena is the best thing to happen to Magic since Magic Online. So, which... Okay, maybe... Maybe I can find a better uh, way to to put that. <laughs> uh, in my defense, when Magic Online came out, it was pretty good. You know, in 1967 or whenever it came out. Oh, this hand is pretty good, actually. Baffling end. See, their enchantment removal. Oh, okay, it's just a Danto. Just a Danto. Last time they tried to make a show out of magic, though, they found the rules were too complicated and birthed the abomination of a dumpster fire. Means. <laughs> uh, do I try and kill this multiple times to see how dedicated they are to it? I paid twice. Yeah, you're probably right. But look, they're at eight life. <laughs> Why are they at eight life? <laughs> yeah, I mean, they uh, apparently they were going to block. Right? Sure. This does mean I'm out of 
tricks. Or creatures, I guess. Yeah. Huh. Hasty friend. Hasty friend. That is not a hasty friend. They're gonna spell pierce me now, too. That's so frustrating. Are they gonna pay for? been through two of three two of my shocks no we want we want tenth legion because tenth legion is lethal if they don't play exactly that never mind no, actually, 10th Legion is still... Oh, we're a land short of lethal. Never mind. We're a land short of lethal. <sighs> ah, yes. My hubris. My hubris. I'm gonna draw like Gideon, which doesn't really do anything. Oh, they're putting Elephant into play? Yeah, see, I'm, a, I'm one land short from even having a, a lethal draw. Alright, so if I had attacked first, there's a chance we would have won that game. Because they decided that they they would rather lose the game than, than lose their thing. Ooh. <laughs> one Mythic Korea. Four notifications. What on earth? <laughs> I'm so confused. Uh, I don't know, man. Anyway, sorry. I'm just looking at Twitter and being confused about certain accounts. Um, man, these hands are just like... A three drop is too slow if you don't have a two drop, right? Oh my gosh. Well, so it's it's this account called Stream Support at Stream Support Four, and they tweeted live again with more Magic: The Gathering by Marty Punker over at, and then it links my my Twitch page, which isn't like harmful in itself, but the way the whole account is structured is sort of like body. Like I didn't I didn't follow them. They don't follow me. It's just how it is. I'm not winning on a multi four. I don't think. Uh, am I? Okay, so look. I have Krinko. Like, I'm debating just passing, but this is a playable hand. They kept seven...
I'm just going to see what they're playing. A guild gate and some creatures. Kind of regret not playing now because I drew a two drop that's really good. It's not that good on this board. Sure, sure, sure. Good idea. Cool. They're ramping Nebraska. That's all I needed to see. All right. Um, lava coil. Sheltering light seems decent. Gosh, I've not even brought that. Well, we haven't faced red, which I assume is where that would come in. Again, I don't like Krinko. I... All right, have a good one, Tom. Thanks for hanging out. Um... Sure. Let's run it like this. See how we do. Play first. <laughs> all right all right this hand is actually okay as far as these types of hands go so we get to play out 10th legion here Rude creature. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Drew a creature, at least. No, you want to cast it down if you have it. No? Okay. Do I have... No, I just have shock. Assassin's Trophy. Um, this lets me leave up Reckless Rage. Which is nice. I like Reckless Rage. It's a good card. Alright, we'll cycle this, I guess. Cycle it again. And we have two Reckless Rages and a Lava Coil in our hand. And an opponent has not played a creature in a while. Sure. 
I guess they're playing green black land destruction. Jokes on you, got 21 of those things. Oh, hey, a creature. Ah, uh, it's dead. Sure. Don't have a lot of creatures in this deck. Field of Ruin. Like, I have so many lands in play. This card has no text. Oh, cool. Now even my slow creatures can go fast? A target. I go fast. Wow. Wish I'd held on to that sprint. Swing a four five. Okay. Well, at least I have a backup creature. And they seem to be running out of things. Play land. Play land. Play land. Do it. Uh. Whenever this deals combat damage to a player or planeswalker, return to your hand target creature or planeswalker, which so far is land or elves. Go ahead. Cat to be kidding me. Oh, my goodness gracious. How did we end up here? How many lands in my graveyard? One, all right, two. Two lands in my graveyard, so two, four, uh, plus six is 10. So 11 lands left in my deck. Hey, 10 lands left in my deck, look at that. <laughs> How do people win? Uh. All right, play first. Two lands, a two drop, a two drop, a three drop. So we can keep. To assess our situation. Whether we want a 10th Street or a Danto. 10th Street it is. Gotta go fast. Search for Ascanta. I have, no, I just have sheltering lights. So this is like Bant Ramp, I think. Yep. Thank you for confirming. I can't play this without leaving up a sheltering light. Yeah, it's fine. All right, Krinko, do your do your stuff, do your thing, do. Yep. Do they float mana? No. Two, 
two, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Plus shock, so there's definitely a fog coming on. Oh. Okay. Tap out for something. Yeah, you're dead. You're dead. <laughs> Uh, what did we do against them? Do we just hit submit? Mm, I like, I like more goblins. All right. More goblins. More goblins it is. Yeah, that's a lot of stuff. Oh my gosh. All right. All right, all right. And we drew the third land. Cool. Lost soul, and that's actually kind of scary. Actually, so, oh, never mind. I thought I had a spell that I do not have. It still gives me a chance to draw it, though. They didn't um, put a counter on this, which surprises me greatly. Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted to see. Uh, yep, yep, yep. Yep. So, Sheltering Light is going to protect our 10th District Legionnaire when they go to blow up this Blast Zone. Uh, yep, they have infinite mana now. Alright, try and blow up your Blast Zone. Sure. Loading mana. Alright, so we're going to gird onto these two friends. Bottom that. Defiant strike this friend. Move to combat. Make some four, four, four goblins there, huh? Why are they not blowing that up, I wonder? Guess they don't want to just one for one. Ugh. Now it's getting a bit rough. Sure. It's Gird for battle again. Yeah, 
enchantment for more creatures. Okay. Uh, I'm still going to attack with Krinko so I can get more goblins because it's fun. Doesn't care about how much damage he does, just cares about his power. Uh, they got four in there, so that's fine. Ah, they found their fifth land. Okay. And second they pop this blast zone is the second they have... Um, no root snare in hand, I think. Sure. My turn. Six. There goes seven. Oh, it's six. Okay. They put the six there early. Got it. Got it. So there's still one short of this. Another blast zone. Uh, I guess. So they pass the turn. I don't know that that game was over. That, what? My brother has sent me a picture. It's a very grumpy looking U2, I think. Emphasis on the question marks. Blah. This hand is awkward, right? Because of these, but I'm still going to keep this. Hopefully they're playing something slow and not white weenie. That is not white weenie. Oh, that's a great draw. Perfect. Perfect. Yep. I'm going to play a Danto out. Means next turn I can go Dread Arcanist into Samus Sprint, Samus Sprint. I'm gonna play a Jade Light Ranger because they always have it and I never do. Uh, Lanamor Elves, Bin, another Walker, Bin. Are they just not gonna attack now that? They see a Danto Vanguard and White Red Lance. Oh, they did attack. Okay. All right. Two, three. Uh, bottom that.
put that here. Uh, sure. They're just going to take eight because they have another J Light Ranger in hand, huh? Uh, we pretend like it matters, but it doesn't. It's okay. Our sideboard game against them is pretty sweet. Actually, cut these Adanto Vanguards, bring in uh, Takatli on our guard, bring in Lava Coil, just mow down these silly creatures. Sure. Sure, I think we're dead. All right, let's get THG in here. Let's get THG up in the house. She's been saying no for a long time now. Uh, Reckless Rage and Lava Coils. Uh, sheltering Light's fine. All right. All right, all right. We found the sweet spot. We did the thing. Play first. Oh, gosh. I want to be so greedy because if that's a land right there, it's just like they can't win. Uh. This deck just doesn't have very good mulligans, huh? Field of Ruin. Sure. Well, we get to shock this and then Defiant Strike this, draw two cards, which is nice. I like drawing cards. Get me out of this mulligan a bit. Land is decent. Ooh, that's even better though. All right. All right, we drew two cards. But at what cost? Uh, you're just too late. Wow, they drew the two lands they need for this Nissa. Chalk this out of the way, hit them for two. Send a message. Gotta protect this. They have the five land, they have six lands even. Don't know why they showed me that one. Come on, have just like a cast down or something. Sure. Quickly becomes a 4-3, huh? 
Defiant Strike, drawing Defiant Strike. That seems okay. All right, so in comes Shaky Nissa. Puts a 3-3 three, three into play. Lion fights for us. Yeah, he should have attacked with that. Cool. Hmm. Just draw a card. Shock, shock. Um... No, we can do better than shock. I guess shock would kill this here. Uh, Salmon Sprint makes that a 3 4. Oh, wow. They um, missed my mistake. They could have killed my 10th District Legionnaire there. Whoops. Definitely could have killed the 10th District. Vivian. That's a big old dino that they can cast next turn. Okay. All right. Um, let's not make the same mistake again. Sure. Kind of just like continuing to draw cards, huh? Like even if they kill this, he has to draw a card and draw me like a million cards already. Now go to the bottom. Oh, and I drew a second one. Drug. Uh, yep. I'll take your land down. Put you down to eight. Play second one of these. And end of the turn. Big old dino. It's scary. Gird for battle. Your newest friend is a chump. Mm, that's not good for battle. Um, three attackers. Let's bring this back. Sure. Draw a card. Rats. Didn't quite get there. It's a trick question, opponent. Cash this in now. 
Lava Coil, not effective against a big old dino. Feathers, interesting. One, two, three. I only have three points of damage. I guess Feather's not that interesting. Balance comes. Balance comes, okay. View the... No. Okay. That doesn't do anything against my board. Even if they play Elf first, that doesn't do anything. Oh, wait. It actually does nothing against my board. <laughs> if they make me shuffle, I think I'll just shuffle. Or this is a four shuffle, right? Yeah, okay. That's fine. That's okay. Yep. It's a land of war elf. Shaking Nissa. Uh, I lost game one, huh? Big ol' no. Okay. So that's one, t no, sorry. This is an ETB effect. They still have to kill Takatli Honor Guard. But if they do, then it's one, two, three, and it's just everything. Yeah, that's everything. Do I commit Feather to this board? I think I do. She's a flying threat. The second they removed Kotli Honor Guard, though, and then, like, just slammed this Massacre Girl, I'm very sad. Oh, they have a freaking Vivian. All right. We're just dead. They just emblem their... I don't know why they're waiting. They can just kill me. It's fine. Everything's fine. They don't know it, but I know it. All right. I have time for one or two more. Let us play first. Sure. A two into a three with a little bit of protection that I will never get to use because I am tapping out every single turn. Shocking. All right. Show me the shock. Come on. Oh, a wizard's deck, you say? <clears throat> Shocking. Oh, they have Reckless Rage too. Jeez. And then they can shock my face. So swing for three here. Nope. And they get to charter course. Wow. I don't have a very good hand.
very neat sleeves. Mine are just very sh shiny with valor. Ooh. This isn't going to end well for them, huh? I'm going to take this opportunity to scry one. Glad I did. I guess it'll end better than I was thinking, because I forgot about the Adelie's pump. Wait, what? I thought I blocked it. I'm confused. Uh, I am confused. So they get to chart a course, which is neat. Oh, no, they don't. They didn't pump this. Sure. Topped? Well, that's scary. You know, if they had opted before combat, they could have pumped this and gotten their chart back. So that's a thought. Uh. Wow. Cards I like. There are a lot. There are a lot. I don't like this friend, but that puts me really low on creatures, right? 17 creatures. Like, Gideon's a creature. Sure. That's 18 creatures. Nope, that's not where I was clicking. Get rid of Sprint. Nope, can't cut creatures. Right, right. Um, gosh. There are no creatures in this list. It's so weird. Couple girds. I'll just get rid of girds. Kind of become a control deck with Gideon Finisher. Play first. Uh, this is a mono white Moldafor, I guess. It's a good mono white Moldafor, though. Solves. Gideon gets in here. Get to uh, plus him. Put it here. Do lifelink. Attack. And then if they block, it's not such a big deal. Gain three life. Pass the turn. All right, kid. Come on, Chad. Now we just need red lands. So they're going to attack it and then, like, bolt it for three. I've seen this story. Oh, they can just... Well, that only puts it to one. Sure. Come on, red source. Okay. 
So this doesn't protect it that well, unfortunately. But they are at eight, which is a pretty low number. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. Just... <laughs> Uh, this deck, I don't know how it got a top 8. Like, the games where it's really good, it's really good. Oh, God, I'm like two wins away? Three? No, wait. I'm three wins away from my stuff. Okay. Uh, that was short. Let's do one more. Captain Kanak. Okay. Want a coin flip. Have a crappy opener. Yeah. Yep. Lead on mountain to hold up shock. Play a land of Do it. They didn't do it. Never listen to me. So I'm going to lead on 10th Legion, 10th District Legionnaire. So next turn, I can go Mountain, Dreadhorde, Salmon Sprint, Salmon Sprint. Lightning strike this in response? No? Okay. Uh, Defiant strike. I'm going to bottom that. Now they're going to kill it? No. Good removal spell. I'll keep it on top. Take eight. Neat. Cute. And this is why we keep this on top. Uh, sure. Yeah. Okay. Lava coils come in. I guess this is where this comes in. Gideon felt good against the last Acro deck, even though they stole my stuff. That, and then we cut a couple of those. Samut Sprint and Girds. Whoop, whoop, whoop. No, 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 no. You get back in my deck. And here it is again, like, I want to keep the, the seven, but the three drops make it so clunky. I don't, uh, all right, land, come on, land, give me a land. Sure. I'm going to let them kill this if they want. Boros, or, yeah. Can't beat that. 
All right, on the play. On the play, I think we can be a little bit cuter. All right, here it is again. Every seven has a three drop and nothing else, and then every six has one land. I'm so off this deck. All right, all right. We get to play magic at least. Being on the play is helpful. Don't play an elf. Of course. Whatever. Power through anyway. Yeah. Keep them off of their uh, fast null hide Ferox. like a third land. We can play this out. Uh, got some one mana spells. I don't mind flashing back next turn, hopefully. There's... Okay, it's the thing. Right. Uh... We have Lava Coils in our deck. Got that going for us. Oh. Okay. I. Yep. Sure. Six sixes. Not really what we're built to kill. In typical me fashion. Nice. I, uh... <laughs> Uh, what am I trying to say here? In typical me fashion, I did well, and then I did poorly, and ended up exactly where I started. So, uh, <laughs> the the issue I have with the deck is it has six three drops and 12 two drops, but any opener that doesn't have a two drop in it feels unkeepable. And I was getting a ton of them, and it doesn't make any sense does not seem mathematically probable that I would have more three... Maybe it's just the fuel bads in the moment, and I didn't actually get as many three drops my opener as I did two drops. Maybe I'm supposed to keep the hands that are, like, a feather and a bunch of, like, one-mana spells. Man, I wish... I wish there was some one-drop. Because you have so many one-drops in your deck, but none of them are good. Like, Shock... Yeah, Shock is literally the only one mana spell that's good without a creature in this deck. Like, Dauntless Bodyguard, maybe? Healer's Hawk? Ha ha ha. Get to Lava Runner is kind of interesting. I just, I don't know. I just don't feel like I'm going anywhere. If I don't have a cheap creature in my opener, and my cheap creature start at two and end at three, and if I, oh, I seven. Okay, I have seven, three drops. Anyway, uh, that is going to do it for me today. 